Now it is. Fuck. Wicked Nattage. <clears throat> What's up, Nom Say Radio? We're it's gone. Nom Say uh, Aliens. Nom Say Radiators. Nom Sayers. Nom Sayer. This is a very important snake break. Mm-hmm. Let's just cut right to the chase. Yes. We have got two free tickets two. to the Pacifier show, right? Pacifier. And it's uh, November 4th, this Sunday. Fourth. And it's not just them. I mean, it's them, whatever, the flyers on our goddamn Sheffield crew and all that shit. Facebook page, yeah. Uh-huh. Sheffield crew, Crazy Carl, somebody else. Yeah. I mean, Resonated's going to be doing the McDidden's thing. We already said that on the other snake breaks. Yeah. But what's good about this snake break is we're going to give you a hint, right, to answer the question tonight on the show yes. in order to get the tickets. And the, I mean, I guess the hint is, so basically whoever gets this right, calls in tonight, answers it correctly, wins the tickets. Yeah, you gotta know the secret code answer, or whatever the fuck you wanna call it. Right, so the, do you wanna do the... Well, um, yeah, sure. It's, okay. um, so we did the, um, we have the first episode, the Lost episodes out, and the first one, the one where Dave Casey's in there. When we talk about boobs and we talk about New Orleans and we talk about, you know, CBFs and all that stuff. The first one that we Very shot first show. at his place with mm-hmm. uh, Thomas Fagan as our special guest. And Kay Carter Films did the uh, video. Yeah. yeah. Um, and audio. Yeah, we just posted it like, I don't know, what, two weeks ago or some yeah, shit? Yeah, about two weeks ago we posted that up. So it's on the, we'll post it again to yeah, the Facebook. Yeah, we'll post so it on can, the Facebook with this shit and all that. Right, we'll do, we'll post the snake break, then that video. Mm-hmm. So you'll have the, you know, what, or we'll post the video, then the snake breaks. So you watch a snake break, then you can, you know, yeah. scroll down Watch below this first, and, watch. and then watch that. Right. And if you already watched that, then watch this. Again. And then go back and watch that. Right. But, um, yeah, there's something that Dave Casey says. It's something that he says in, in the episode. Yeah, something, some, you know, one of his one-liners that he yeah. says in there. Um, if you don't know who Dave Casey is, he's the old guy with the long hair. And he's going to be calling in tonight. We're going to be talking He's either him. calling in or we're going to call him because we actually have his real number now. His right. Florida number. So Yeah, he, the rumor has it that Dave Casey is currently located in Florida somewhere to he's stay. He's somewhere, yeah. Like, he lives here again. He found his old cardboard box and now he's living here again. And we want to know, do you guys want David Casey on the show? Do you think he's funny? Do you want us to tell him to fuck off? And not be a part of the show because we love the guy. He kind of left in some really sour terms yeah. with people that didn't even do anything to him. But he's a fucking psychopath, anyways. He's just old. He's just he's senile, man. I mean, he's he's paranoid and shit. He thinks that we hate him or something. We don't. We love you, dude. Yeah. Call in tonight. We're making the fucking pacifier tickets about you and something you <laughs> said on the first show. So you don't even have to fucking say you're sorry. It's all good. Yeah. It's water under the bridge, bitch. Bitch fist your face the next time I see you, and it's all good. Yeah. Might kick you in the junk, cock punch you or something. But whatever, man. <laughs> we'll talk to him again. Yeah. He's around. He's back in town. You never know. We can bring him in. We got a opening in fucking December, some shit. Right. Well, so, uh, and also, too, we have something that's going on at State Theater. We're going to be giving out four tickets for. Um, and we're not going to tell you who that is just yet, it? but we're going to announce that on the show tonight as well. We're really giving out those tickets? Yeah. Why not, dude? I guess if they're free, if you, you know. It's to help out a local business, dude. That dude's not local. The band yeah, but it helps playing? out the fucking venue that he's going to be at. Where's he playing? At State Theater. All right, then I guess it'll work out. Yeah, State Theater's awesome. That's where Resonate had their CD release party and shit. Yeah. Is that really? That was, yeah. Oh, okay. That was State Theater, was State Theater? Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, yeah. We'll have about State Theater. The and if you noticed, I cut off the bottom... I don't have this thing anymore. Just the just the mustache. This is the official first day of November. Mm-hmm. Still got the choppies, and I got the stashy. Yeah, I woke up too late, so I didn't shave. Well, it's the first day, so I'll shave it up. I don't know what I'm going with. I might go with the shh and just connect it shh all the way. Yeah, that'll be pretty gay. Yeah, you should do that. Fuck you, man. Look at your fucking stupid ass sideburns. Dude, these are fucking tight, bro. I mean, I spent a while. Making sure these are legit. But what, even? Spent a while in the mirror looking at yourself, making sure that this one matched up to that one? Yeah, well, that's the old blonde, that's the blonde thing to do. That's what all blondes do. We just stare at ourselves in the mirror because we're fucking beautiful as shit. I bet you when you watch 
fucking snake breaks over, you pause it and just stare at yourself. Mm -hmm. I'm like, God damn, look at those fucking blue eyes, man. Beautiful. Look at this. Look at this mug. Get your fucking face out of the fucking camera. Hi, <laughs> sorry, Rick. <laughs> sorry, bro. <laughs> I almost so, feel like I look like a goat. <laughs> that one you got in there. <laughs> That's why we're asses are on radio. Bah, bah. All right, so show uh, 18 tonight. Oh, the election show. Yep, uh, we got the election special. Um, Gary Johnson sign right there. I think your other one in the back just fell. Um, mm, smells like Telemore We have What's artillery. Up, oh, sorry. Joining us tonight. Um, we'll talk about his birthday. We'll talk about uh, how Ratchet's still in jail. Talk about his new music video. Talk about whatever the fuck we want. Um, Kate Carter Films might be coming in. She's a little bit underneath the weather, so... It's we actually different. have some really dope cup topics for tonight, right? I do have a few, yes. Yeah, and I got do a couple, a few too. too. Artillery has been pitching in on the cup topics, oh, yeah? so... He gave me a few, so we're going to bring those up, and I think you're going to like the cup topics. Mm-hmm. Then we got the CBFs at the end of the show. Mm -hmm. Shit, so there'll mm -hmm. be some good ones there. Do we want to announce what next week's show is going to be, or will we say that on air? And uh, that, save that for another snake break. All right, we're gonna we gotta talk about it anyway. So, all right, what are we talk it. about? Um, oh, right, the topic. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's about uh, we're gonna do show nineteen. It's about uh, outer space and aliens and shit that's all the way up there. Yeah, like the cosmos. Like nobody knows. They call it space. It's like uncharted territory for the most part. We got. Like, some things out there like nobody really knows so we're just gonna have a whole show about it aliens anything space mm -hmm. what nasa's up to i what think we got an acoustic set uh next week too imani yeah nice. imani's coming in and uh the guy who does our opening act i think his name's justin or some shit uh, excuse me excuse my reach yeah, he's kind of just you know all in personal space right sorry, now. sorry dude i'm right in between your cock punch but this bitch we've had her on before she was on the uh improv or no the open mic show which I, I don't know if, which one that was that was the one that showed up fucking a half an hour late yeah so yeah she's coming out with a, I think like a new CD and um, she's got like uh, something going on downtown the f where's she from South America no nah, she's from Hawaii oh hey Hawaii so she's gonna be <laughs> on the show so maybe she'll have some uh, yeah I think she's gonna do an cool acoustic space set. stuff cause she's got a show where she's doing acoustic shit um, oh, like dude, the following week, so I, I need to know. I'm say certify this real quick. Right on her cheek. No, I won't do it like that. <laughs> Sorry <laughs> if you see this. <laughs> Imani is not say certified. If you don't have one of these on your CD, your CD isn't shit. Fuck no. So yeah, that's the next show, Space Aliens, Monty, and, uh, Acoustic, and then we got the CBF Awards the following week, Show 20, and some fucking brewing companies coming in. And Ludwig, fucking Ludwig. Some assholes with mustaches that are coming in. Oh yeah, where is Sinclair? We're going to have him on. So, I mean. So we got some stuff going on. Some Waldo looking motherfuckers. And I don't know if we've already told you, but for the pacifier on Sunday, we're going to be live interviewing the bands before they go on yes backstage very nonce style and uh yeah yep we'll be talking with them um, we're gonna try to you stream it so it posts before the show but we'll see how elite media is gonna be time to show that. start up good question that's why you go to the facebook page because we got the fucking banner it probably starts at like our shit. eight dude or some shit eight yeah, or nine eight, you know what do they play like four songs and they're done yeah, yeah, something some like that. Like They'll play like yeah. an hour set. Yeah, he got one CD. Yeah, like most of the time, like the in, the first couple bands will play like their best four, and then as it, it goes yeah. on, they'll whatever. The pacifier is the. It's at Janice Live. Right? Janice Live? Dude, I hate neck pimples, bro. I gotta scratch them. I bet the back of my neck looks like a fucking pizza. Ugh. I bet you nobody gives a fuck about what the back of your neck looks like or your motherfucking pimples. People behind me do. Man, people behind don't want to fucking tell you that shit. And it's all well, busted open looking. and you got dry motherfucking scabs and shit. Yeah. You rotten motherfucking dirty ass, hillbilly looking white boy. Nah. Go face. Nah. Dirty ass. Nah. Three day wearing underwear. Fucking don't wipe your asshole from back to front. You wipe it from the back then. Dude, I actually 
I wanted to talk about that on the show because I was always a back to front type guy until I got this shit on my balls. Well, are you? And people were like, "Dude, stop wiping." Obviously, that's what's happening. You're getting a little bit of residue on your nuts as you come up back to front through the legs, and then I start. You know, I'm doing like the lean and front to back now. Were well, you going like this and like digging under? Yeah. Like you, you, you're reaching for fucking gold? Like, right, like I would go in between my legs in the toilet bowl underneath. Yeah. But just, now yeah, I man, lean you over. Lean on the, you gotta lean, lean on the toilet and then the I, go, on the I go front to back now. You gotta do one for a cheap. while I was doing both. I was like, well, I'll go, I'll swipe it this way and then swipe it the other way and then swipe. It's just so much work. Do left-handed people wipe their ass from front to back or back to front? I don't know. There's a huge controversy behind if you should which way you're supposed to do it. Apparently in China they shit like birds and they just squat down on a fucking well, in, in a hole. Well, they got that shit that uh, sprays water in the asshole. Do they? Yeah. No, that's like the French. Uh, that's what is France. it? Nah. Japanese people do. Do they? I guess. I mean, they got technology and shit. No, Chinese people. I don't know about Japanese people. It's the same fucking thing. No, it's yeah, it is. Yeah. Sorry if you're Japanese. Oh, we are still looking for an Asian fucking Jewish intern. You can, you can do our accounting. But you have to be an eight or above, not eight years old. I'm talking about eight on a rating scale. Yeah. Or above, um, mm -hmm. Jewish and Asian and a female. Mm -hmm. And that's all the requirements and shit on our page. Are we, uh, you don't have to be those things, but that's where the bar set. You can be white and, and a we, Jew. I don't think we can get sued for this because we're not actually going to pay them anything. No, they're interns. We'll be working for free. We'll give you college credit and shit. Yeah, we're no, legit. yeah and we're totally legit to do that, by the way. Yeah. So don't believe it or not. Yeah, we can. We can give you college credit. Right. We can sign some shit off. We're a business. Yes. I, I we're, mean, we have an LLC. I think that limited looks right, liability corporation. Fuck yeah. Nom say LLC. Google it. It exists. Mm hmm. Fucking own that shit. And you fucking work for us. Right. For free. Free. Bitch. It's not slave work. You're just getting college credits. If you're not in college. And you're working for us. Um, we'll give you beer. Yes. If you're over 21. Yes, if you're over 21. If you're over 18, we will allow you to smoke illegal marijuana. No. We'll give you. If cigarettes. you bring it yourself, I mean, we don't. Well, we don't condone that shit. I yeah, mean, if you guys just do, won't. then you know it's your own body. So if you want to do that to yourself, we can't stop you. Yeah. We're not the cops. We're not your fucking parents. But we're not going to contribute to minors. Hell no. Now I'm saying radio. Not pedophiles. Just legalize it though. Gary Johnson. Man, it looks like it's fucking like an iPod commercial. You know what I mean? Where it looks all white and shit? I wonder if that'll look like that on the replay. Yeah, because it's recording this shit. I've never done this one before. Ugh. <laughs> All right, dude. Fucking, I guess that's a snake break. Uh, yeah, we got the show tonight, dude. So we can save some material for that shit. Call in one eight six six eight two six thirteen four D. If you want those pacifier tickets, pacifier tickets. You got to be in the fucking area because we're not paying for you to fucking come down here and go see the no, show. No. You got to anybody be that's gonna around. call in is probably gonna want to go to the pacifier concert already, and it, you know. It's ten bucks out the door, five dollars advance, so you still have time to get cheap tickets. Also, yeah. go to Ticketmaster, check that out. Pacifier. Uh, uh, what is Janice Live? Janice Live. Sunday. 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 Um. Yeah, I guess it's it, gotta be it. Yeah, we're fucking good. We got a show to do later. Yeah. All right. Bye, guys.